Hey, I got that too. Bones. Dramatic fight off the end of the ship. So dramatic, guys. So dramatic. What's gonna happen? Wow, that's brutal. Oh no! Look at you. What makes you so damn special? Why you and not me? Hang on. Because the magic of friendship, fool. That's why. Ha, ah, pwned. <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> Thanks. What about this pie jack? Here, take my hand. And then, and then you live. For what? Okay, bye. I'm not sure that would kill the real Commander Shepard. But I guess she's a clone, so... Oh well. Fortunately, they weren't here long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from James cleaning up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus they overloaded the heat diffusion system firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but Shuttle Guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. That's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. What about Edie? Is she back online? I am once again fully in control of the Normandy. Ah, get phone. Glad to hear it. What about the Mercs? Any survivors? Just one crappy-ass pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high-security facility. Maybe she can give him some dirt on Cerberus. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. Maya. I know that voice. Do you really? You're getting a chance to redeem yourself. Don't waste it. So, serious. Admit it. Some part of you liked having me around. Looking up to the legend? We had some laughs. And who knows? Maybe we'll have more someday. No, we won't. Because you're gonna stay in your cell and do your time. Afraid I'll escape. Come back for revenge. Is the great Commander Shepard pleading for her life? I'm pleading for yours. So thoughtful. <sighs> Then I suppose I'm off to lock up. You know, she wouldn't have let me live. You can't clone everything. When the old days, we just shot her. Huh. Good time. Well, that's it for the missions for the Citadel DLC, although there's a lot more to this DLC still. Not actual missions though, more fan service. And um The rest of the squad's waiting outside. We'll have the Normandy back in shape in no time. Appreciate it. Man, I love shore leave. <laughs> Come on, maybe we can take some actual time off. No explosions or anything. Just us. I don't know about no explosions, but just us sounds perfect. Yay, happy ending! For this DLC at least, unlike the rest of the game, which is utterly depressing. So yeah, there's a whole lot of fan service in here. 
I might show you a little bit of it. I'm not going to show you all of it, unfortunately for you guys. Because it's kind of long. It's uh, it's kind of just, just fan service, really. It doesn't really contribute to the story. And... I want to give you some incentive to buy the game. So, after a hard day spent fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next. A nap? Please. We party down. Well, I gotta get going. Things to settle up before I head back to Tuchanka. Always fires to put out when you're in charge, right? Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya. Party, huh? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. All right. Good idea. Let's set it up. I've channeled discretionary funds into your account for the purchase of any celebratory supplies, Commander. Yes. Okay. Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait, wait. I am in charge of the guest list. Yeah, so there's no uninvite button on this thing? <sighs> Alright, but when it's time, I invite the rest. Cortez just invited James. So... Fine. I'm gonna go out and see how much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. Yes. If you require activities, Silver Sun Strip has an arcade in addition to the casino. You have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. Thanks, Glyph. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself. Yeah, so there's an arcade for some mini games. Not that in not interesting though. Um the combat simulator is f is fairly good. Kind of repetitive after a while, but fairly good. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, the casino is not that good. Like the gambling is, is pretty pretty flat. Although maybe maybe you are a gambling kind of person. I'm not really a gambling kind of person. So we have to throw a party. And uh, I'm not going to show you the party. I'm not really going to show you any of the uh, the other people's. But I'll, I'll give you. I'll, I'll do one or two. Just to show you what the uh, what the idea is, right? So we have a uh, an apartment. I think they just made a. F hmm. I guess they have a wish list somewhere of what fans want. I guess fans really want it to be with Rex again, you know, because Rex is pretty awesome. So yeah, you, we, there was absolutely no mention of Reapers in the entire DLC. Um, alright, so there's a private terminal. So, let's see. From your friends at Armax Arsenal Arena. So that's the arena. I'm not going to read all of it, but we can play in the arena. So Steve wants to hang out. Uh, Samantha Trainer wants to go to lunch. Sure leave. Edie wants to uh, hang out. Koyat wants to have a memorial for his father. James Vega has something to show me. Javik is visiting the Citadel. The Arata Sony is wants to hang out. Garrus Vakarian wants to hang out. Miranda Lawson wants to hang out. Oh wait, this is something else. This is something different. This is actually work. Ah, oh, this is actually the quest. Sorry, this is part of the main quest. This is not the uh, not part of the DLC. I don't think this is part of the DLC neither. Memorial? Okay. Okay, my sister got everything set up at the Citadel Memorial. She showed me what she's gonna put up on the wall. It's nice. I wish I could do something to make this easier for her. She wants me to say something about our family. I know you're busy, but it would mean a lot for you to be there. Okay, this is the main game. This is not the DLC. That's not the DLC neither for Miranda. I discovered a few things about my sister. It's bad. But there's something else going on. I'm back on the Citadel. I'll find a place to meet and send you a nav point when you get here. And take a break. Get us for carrying. I thought the next time we were at the Citadel, maybe we could take a break. Can't fight a war with a little R and R once in a while. I'll be hanging around the sea near the shuttles if you're interested. So these things are the um are your squad mate activities, I guess. 
in the main game, and then these things are like squad mate activities in the Citadel DLC. Oh, actually, come meet me next. I need an excuse to tear myself away from all these monitors. Come see me the next time we dock at the Citadel. Actually, no, this is also part of the main game. These are the DLC stuff down here. Um, all right. Who should we talk to? So we can invite up Edie or James or Koyat. Let's um, like which one should I show you? None of these are particularly good. Let's go with um, James. Oh, actually, maybe this is a good idea, or a bad idea, depending on your opinions on lifting. <laughs> hey, Lola. Nice place. Might not look so nice after throwing that party you were talking about. You wouldn't trash my new apartment, would you, James? Me? No. Never. <whistles> nice view. But this place, it's just so... not what I'm used to. Which is? I grew up on the beach on the Pacific, so, you know, water, sand, real air. You miss it? Yeah. And the people. So, what's her name? <laughs> no. No. I stopped fraternizing when I joined the military. The two don't seem to go well together. Hasn't stopped you from being a shameless flirt. Yeah, well, that's just my way. I don't mean anything by it, Lola. Too bad. Ha! Who's the shameless flirt now? So you can give it, but you can't take it. No. I just... You're my commander, por Dios. <laughs> I can never tell if you're yanking my chain or not. Let's not. Let's not do this. I'm, 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 I am yanking your chain. Well, not really. That, that sounds kind of gross. Let's not do this. It's my job to keep you on your toes, Lieutenant. Any way I can. <laughs> job well done, then. Good to know I haven't lost my touch. I assume you had a reason for coming to see me? Oh, shit. Right. I wanted to show you. N7, yes. What do you think? Looks good. And you've earned it. Now the real work begins, right? Exactly. And I heard what you said before. And I'm in. Cien por ciento. Glad to hear it. Anyway, that's it. Just wanted to show you that bad boy. I gotta get back to the Normandy. Esteban wants my help working on the shuttle. Thanks for coming by, James. This is gonna be a perfect place for a fiesta. Hasta la vista, Shepard. They did a really good job animating his muscles. Were you guys paying attention? Like, you know, his muscles look really good, like there wasn't any animation glitches or anything. What's he doing? <laughs> You've been holding out on me. And he starts playing with the gym. All right, so there's there's that. Hold on. Pull up bar. Use. Do you guys lift? Hey Shepard, you know my record is 182. You think you can beat it? 182. Oh, this should be good. Alright, I'm gonna do this. 182. <laughs> so basically you're just pressing the left or the right mouse button 183 times until you beat him. <laughs> Not bad. Oh, I lift. I lift, James. 
So I don't know how sensible this is. <coughs> I'm not sure why they put this in the game. Other than there's some sort of... I mean, Bioware understands good game design. So if they were doing this seriously... I mean, they wouldn't do this seriously because they know it's a bad idea. It gets really boring, by the way. 183. Although I'm talking to you guys now, so maybe that'll be less boring. You look like a pro. I am a pro. Shut up, Vega. Touchy, touchy. So apparently my wimpy little girl <laughs> arms are strong enough to lift myself up 183 times. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, no, no decent game developer would <clears throat> think that this is a good idea to put in the game. Unless as some sort of joke, which I think this is. Maybe it's like a, you know, maybe the. That's twenty. They're trolling about you know quick time events and things like that. And maybe it is a commentary on quick time events, cause she's pulling herself up, whereas I'm just sitting here with my you know legs crossed. Hand on the mouse, clicking these buttons. You know, being decidedly unfit. Whereas she's doing all these pull-ups. 